Hey everyone, welcome back. Happy Friday, happy Create Your Lane fashion happy hour. Hi everyone, my name is Megan O'Connor. I'm a fashion stylist. I come to you live every single Friday, 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time for a fun fashion chat. I'm here to help you create your lane with a little fashion inspiration. Welcome everyone, as you log on, come on, say hi, give me a wave, tell me where you're joining from. Today's rack is going to be a really great one because it's all about fall layering. And that is a fashion moment that we all can have this fall with tons of great pieces from ponchos to sweaters to coats and more. We have it all today, we're talking about it all on this rack and I'm super excited to jump into it with all of you today. So again, welcome everyone. If you're new here, hi, tell me you're new, tell me you're just joining. My name is Megan O'Connor, I'm a fashion stylist and I come to you live every Friday, 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time for a fun fashion chat. Hi, everyone. Let's see. I see Alabama, Virginia, New York, Maryland. Hi, welcome. I'm so happy to see you all here with me today. Thank you so much for joining California. Welcome, everyone. Quick reminder, if you're new here, I answer three questions during today's live. Those three questions are gonna be submitted using the question box at the bottom of the screen, right down there. You're gonna go ahead and put those questions in as we go through the rack today. I answer questions between each look, and if I answer your question, drum roll, you get a $50 gift card. Who does not love that, am I right? Hi everyone, I see you all joining on. Minneapolis, Minnesota, Missouri, Maryland, North Carolina, Detroit. My gosh, thank you so much for being with me here today for this week's episode of Create Your Lane fashion happy hour. Should we get into it? I feel like we should get right into it because there's so much to talk about, so many good layering pieces, and I can't wait to tell you at the end, of course, how you can how you can save this weekend. So, shall we? Oh, it is time. We are in fall, full fall fashion mode, and that means for some of us, the temperatures are changing. And as these temps change, we are talking all about layering sweaters, adding those cozy extras to not only create your personal style and really kind of enhance your look, but of course also for the practicality of it, the fashion of it, the mix and match of it all. So that is what today is all about. We're covering fall layering. And I have a couple of different options here for you. We're talking poncho, open front sweaters, jackets, jackets, all of the things so that you can easily mix and match with pieces you may already have and pieces that you may be looking to shop this weekend, whether you're shopping online or in store. So let's get into it, shall we? Um, okay, I'm gonna jump right in and then we will talk about how you can save and all that fun stuff later because I am super excited to talk about this rack today. Now, look number one, I had to do it and I'm gonna kick it off with this Libby because this set was such a wonderful, little pleasant, cozy surprise moment and I wanted to figure out how we can kind of um, layer this option with something unexpected because my normal go-to would have probably been throwing maybe a leather jacket over it or a denim jacket or even a shacket if you will but I thought let's talk about ways that we can add on a sweater so that we really kind of get that cozy knit experience on top of having this lounge fantastic moment so let's talk about the base item and then I'll talk about your layer so the base item is this Libby Active set oh man this is so comfortable. I wish you could touch it through the screen. I'm going to come close so you can see the color too because it's really beautiful. But this is so soft to touch. I wonder if you can just like just take a minute. Just take a minute and stare at that fabric and see how fantastic it is because this is really one of those pieces. I mean you can't see the fuzziness but it's so comfortable. It's so easy to wear and it's such a piece that you can definitely get your um, wear out of it. It's gonna do more for you in your wardrobe because it can be worn as separates, it can be worn together as a set, and then of course it can be worn as a layered look like what we're talking about today. So this is a Libby Active. Now this is a pull-on style pant. You have that adjustable drawstring there. Don't worry, they're there. I'm gonna show you, they're here. You have the pockets, of course. It is so soft to touch, super soft, really gorgeous. Now this is that kind of tan oatmeal color. Um, I'm gonna take a step back so you can see the length because this has a great length to it and it is not a tapered bottom. So for those of you who prefer to have a pant that is a pull-on style, but not an elastic waistband bottom, not a tapered bottom, this pant is for you. It kind of has a straight leg, very, very tiny tapering at the bottom, but minimal, like barely anything. You can see right there, it is straight throughout the whole leg. So you're gonna get a real relaxed fit when it comes to this pant. Then you're gonna have your sweatshirt, which is this pull-on style, pullover style, super cute. And then I'll come close so you can see it, but you can see there you have a little bit of that uh, step hem there on the bottom. So what you're gonna get here is not only this is like a style element, but this is actual practical 
moment here when it comes to designing because this is going to give you a little extra length and a little extra coverage on the back side. So you're gonna get a little bit more there so that in case you have a little lift, you're still gonna get the coverage that you desire. This again, you have that long sleeve and you have that beautiful ribbing detail on both the waistband and on the sleeves of this sweatshirt. This is so, be I'm obsessed with this set. So I thought, like I said before, normally I would probably do like a moto jacket or a denim jacket or even a jacket like similar to what I'm wearing, but I thought let's talk about how we can layer it with a sweater because it is sweater weather. So I paired it with this animal print open front tie cardi. So here's the thing. I have the tie tied at the back because I want to show you how easy it is to wear open front. And then you can adjust and create your shape as desired with that, that kind of self tie here that comes with it. So you have this fantastic like tiger print, animal print paired back. So not only are you creating trend, comfort, a layering look, but then on top of it, you're also creating this sort of monochromatic moment as well. So you're really checking off the boxes with this outfit. So let me show you again. I'm going to step back so you can see everything paired together. You have your Libby sweatpant. You have that pullover sweatshirt and that gorgeous, beautiful, I mean, the super soft. These are incredible to touch all three pieces. And then for that extra added layer, we added this animal print open front cardigan. And this is so great. You have a slight drop shoulder here. Really, really beautiful. And then with this style, let me just show you again so you can see you have that tie that comes with it. So you can absolutely adjust as needed when it comes to this sweater. You can wrap it around the front. You can kind of create different kind of waistline there if you want to highlight your shape. So lots of versatility with that one. So that's look number one. Before we get into look number two, I'm going to answer a question. So if you haven't already, go ahead and put your question using the question box at the bottom of the screen. Coming to you. Hi, everyone. I'm so happy to see you all. Thank you so much for joining me. Okay. This is the part of the live where I have to scroll and read and pick a question and answer the question without having too much dead air. So wait with me. Bear with me just for one second so I can find a great question that can help everybody. And that relates to what we're chatting about today, shall we? Okay. Scrolling. Hold on one second. My wonderful friends. I'm so happy to see you all here with me. Thank you. Um, okay. Let's see, let's see, scrolling, scrolling, scrolling. Oh my gosh, so many questions in here today. Thank you for these. Um, my gosh, hi everyone. Thank you, there's so, so many questions in here. Thank you so much. Okay, so let's talk about, oh, this is a good question. All right, uh, Be Rich 1116 does the tan Livy outfit hold its shape well, and especially the sweater. So this is a really good question because I think a lot of times uh, when it comes to like sweatsuit outfits and then also when it comes to denim, I think we talk about this often too. Do the pieces keep their shape? Do they kind of uh, open up a little bit throughout the day or do we need to adjust and all those things? Let me tell you right now, this Livy set keeps its shape and it's so good because it's loungewear. So it's not fitted to you, right? You're gonna still have some movement with it. You're gonna have this like open, comfortable, feeling with the sweatpants. Like I said, they are straight leg. They have an elastic waistband. You're going to have that oversized vibe with the sweatshirt because it is meant for comfort and lounge. So you're not having anything fitted. And then what you're going to get with that sweater on top of it is that then you can kind of create that shape. So you're not going to lose shape in any of those pieces. They don't stretch out throughout the day. They keep their shape. They're really well made. They're beautifully constructed pieces that all work together to kind of create this great look. So it's a really good question. Thank you for that. Now, moving on to look number two, shall we? And then if you haven't put in a question, you can go ahead and put that in there at the question box at the bottom of the screen. Let's get into look number two, because look number two, I wanted to do something interesting about combining this kind of rugged idea and then adding a little glam. So think about fall fashion. We always think about something with a denim, maybe a plaid. So we started, I started this look with this straight fit skinny, this high rise and the dark rinse. So this is a straight fit which is my preferred fit. Of course, you know, you can get three different fits when it comes to the denim. You can get straight, signature, or curvy. All that information, of course, can be found online or with a sales, sales associate if you're shopping in store. But I took this dark denim jean and then I paired it with this super cute black and white plaid that has this gold all the way through it with the star detail. So this alone is just super fun and exciting as a standalone piece. And that's kind of what I wanted to do with all of these looks today is have these exciting pieces that can be worn on their own and then add those layers in to create a little more of an exciting look together. So again, you have the dark denim, which is really great, kind of a clean line, really beautiful, easy bottom that can be worn a hundred different ways. 
that plaid, which is sort of your quintessential fall moment, except this one's a little bit special because you have that gold in there and you have that star detail, which is so, so pretty, so beautiful. And then I thought, let's glam this up a little bit. I was a little inspired by that gold detail through the thread here and that star. So I said, let's kind of add a little glam to it, shall we? And so the layer for this look, oh yes, oh yes, here we go. This is what we've all probably been waiting for, right? This is like a fan favorite, I think. So let's talk about it. This is the faux fur hooded bomber jacket. And it's incredible. Just hear me out, listen to me now. It is incredible. It is so soft, so comfortable, really, really fantastic. And creates this like luxe add on moment of like a sprinkle of glam, if you will. So let me come close so you can see this. I mean, hello, this is stun stunning. Let me step back, there we go. So you can just see a little bit more. So this is the faux fur, really, really soft to touch, black, gorgeous, and then it's bomber style. So you have that banded sleeve there, and then you're gonna have that banded on the bottom too. So you kind of have this like sporty take on a glam piece, which is really fantastic and kind of creates this great look and this mix and match moment with the juxtaposition of the plaid and the denim. So you have these all these pieces mixed together to create a really great layered look. So again, this is that faux fur bomber jacket. I'll show you the sleeve length, there you go. You have that elastic, this has some stretch to it here and so does the bottom as well. Really gorgeous, zip up style. You do have pockets in the jacket. And then of course you have this hood detail as well, which is fantastic. So this is the add on layer to that plaid denim look. So you have your plaid, you have your denim, you want a little sprinkle of glam, here you go. So this is another really great piece. And then I thought, you know, I had to kind of also show an extra add on because I really couldn't edit it down. So I'm gonna show you quick another option. If you wanna add another layer into that look or any look, a simple piece like this poncho, this pull on style poncho is a great way to do that. So this, for example, could work just as easily with that. Let me just grab it for you so you can see with that plaid because you're gonna put it right over. You're gonna pop your collar through this opening here so you can get a peek of your print. And this is a fantastic way to kind of still have a lot of movement and a lot of comfort when it comes to breathability because this is just a light over piece. So you're gonna throw that right on over and you're just your sleeves are gonna pop out underneath. This is no fastenings, nothing other than just a pull on style poncho. So I thought this was a really cool piece that I kind of didn't wanna leave off, right? So let me come close so you can see it one more time. Then I'm gonna answer the next question. If you haven't put a question in, do it now. And then we're gonna get into look number three, which I know everyone is dying to see because this poncho is so good. Okay, let's see how we're doing. Questions. Don't forget, if you're new here, you gotta put those questions in the question box at the bottom of the screen. That's where I scroll to see them all. Okay, let's see how we're doing. Scrolling, scrolling, scrolling. Hold on, my friends. Um, okay. Scrolling. Bear with me one second. So many. Oh my goodness. Hold on, hold on. Oh my gosh. All right. Let's see. Okay. Scrolling. Okay, this is a good question. Uh, wanting to layer since I live in Florida, but don't wanna look like a square. So, okay, here's the thing. Um, and this is from Tracy D313. I think we all need to remember that we can have fun with fashion and we wanna look good and feel good, but a lot of it has to do with picking pieces that you're gonna feel confident in so that you can kind of have fun with the layering and with all of your mixing and matching pieces. So here's my answer for you, Tracy. First of all, you're in Florida, so you wanna do a layering option, but you probably don't wanna overheat too much, right? You don't wanna have something too bulky because you are need lighter layers. So let's talk about maybe what we just mentioned. I'll show you one more time. Taking a plaid shirt like this, not only can it be worn buttoned up, but you can also unbutton and wear it over a tank. You can wear it open, tie it over maybe a black cotton maxi dress. You can mix and match a lot there when you have those seasonalities. Not everybody is doing a fall layering look for temperatures, right? We just wanna do it for fashion. So you can take that plaid button down and then this kind of poncho piece, if you don't want something heavy like that jacket, this is a really, really easy way to do a layered look, not overheat, not lose your shape. You still wanna show off what you have underneath. This is one of those pieces, because here's the thing. 
you have that V front, you have that color blocking, really great. But then all along the side here, this is a completely open pull-on piece. So what you're gonna get is lots of movement and you're gonna be able to see all of all, all the things that you have underneath. You'll be able to show off your jeans or your pants, your shirt, all the mix and match other pieces, your base layers are all showcased when you have a poncho option like this. So this is a really great way, especially for those warmer temp people, a really great way to kind of have that fall fashion layer moment without overheating, being too bulky, anything like that. So let me show you again. I'll come close because we kind of breeze through this one, but that's a great question. And this is part of the answer. It all worked out. So this is a really fine, light gauge knit. So it's very lightweight. Let me show you if you can see. So you can see how kind of easy that knit is. Really, really light, very easy to wear. So this definitely is an option for you. And especially for those of us who also kind of want to have a light layer, you want to add something, but you don't want to go too all out, or maybe you're just dipping your toe into layering. This is a great option. Okay. I don't know. Every week I say I don't have favorites and I really don't because I love all the pieces, but this might be my favorite because it's so beautiful. It is so cozy. It's so cute. It has a beautiful color story and it could be worn so many different ways. Oh, here it is. I wish I had a drum roller, like sound effects, because this would have it. Now, let's talk about this poncho, shall we? This is a seamed side. So this definitely, you're gonna have a full armhole, not like the other one that I showed you that is a pullover, this is a full armhole. This also has a hood, clean back. The colors on this are so fall beautiful. I mean, it's just fantastic. Then you have your fringe detail on the bottom, which is also just adding to it, just like a little bit of trend, touching on top of the, I mean, there's so many great pieces here or aspects to this. You have front pockets on this baby, two front pockets on this, and then it's a full open front style poncho. So no fastening on the front, no zips, no buttons, nothing like that. This is a full open front style. What does that mean? Why am I talking about it so seriously? Because it can be layered over other pieces and it can be a standalone item. And then of course you can add on certain things like a belt or maybe a self tie belt from something else and cinch in that waist if you wanted to. You can really play around with proportion when it comes to a piece like this. So what I did was I paired it, of course, you know how I feel about these faux leather leggings. I recently talked about them on a previous live. These are incredible. This is in the brown. They also come in black, but this is a pull on style faux leather leggings. So I paired it with this to get that texture story. And then I thought, let's talk about adding a light layer underneath that would create a look without having too many pieces. And you can absolutely wear them alone or together. And that's where I pulled in this mock neck swing tee. Oh, this is such a good piece because it's super lightweight and very comfortable. So what you're getting with this is you're getting that look. If you're like me and you overheat, you're getting that look, you're getting that kind of mock neck, that turtleneck item, but it's very lightweight and really easy to wear. So this is an incredible piece because you are still getting that fashion, but you're not sacrificing it for your comfort. So I put it on underneath this poncho. And again, this poncho is really for everybody because you don't have to worry about fastenings. You have a really easy style here, and then you can put it on and wear it with multiple different things. And it does kind of become this sort of one and done one size piece that can be worn over other pieces as well. So think about if you have on another coat underneath, maybe you have on a leather jacket or a denim, you want another cozy layer, this is it. So let me come close so you can see them paired together. Ah, oh, so gorgeous. Oh my gosh, this is really so beautiful. So let's talk about the colors in here. You have that mauve, that yellow, that blue, that tan, of course. Then you go into the darker tans over there, sort of an ombre look. And then of course you have the larger plaid paneling. So that's the back of it. And then you have that fringe on the bottom and a hood. So really fantastic. I'll come close so you can see that texture because it is fuzzy. It does have this really sort of like cute fuzzy texture here as well, just so you can see that. And then like I said, pockets and who doesn't love that moment? Love a pocket moment. So really functional, great piece, really great fashion item. If you're looking to kind of add something with a lot of pizzazz that also can work over time in your wardrobe. This is a fantastic item to do that with. So again, let me hold it here with the full leather leggings just to show you that option. Oh my gosh, I love it. I see a lot of hearts. That means you all love it too. Okay, let's get into the third question and then I'm gonna tell you how you can save if you're shopping this weekend. Okay, hi everyone. Let's do this, shall we? One more question. Let's see, let's see. 
Hold on, my friends. Scrolling, scrolling, scrolling. Okay. This is a good question. So always Camden's, what are the boot options for fall? So here's the thing, and I'm glad you actually asked this question because it really plays into what we're talking about because I want you to also consider boots can be considered part of your layered look. It is a layer. So if you're somebody who's like, I cannot do a jacket or a poncho, Megan, it's too hot. I don't want it. I don't want anything to do with that. It's not for me. A great way to create a layered look is to do it with your accessories, with smaller items, and with your footwear. You can absolutely do a layered look with your boots. So for example, you can take a knee-high style boot like this lug boot here, pair it with a legging or a skirt or a dress, do a tight underneath it, that's all layering. You're taking multiple items and building them together in one look. That is a layered look, my friends. It doesn't have to be this over piece, this heavy piece, this poncho, this jacket. You can have fun with the layered looks. Let's talk about layering. Boots with tights, boots with leggings. You can do a combat boot like this one up here or a chunky uh, Chelsea boot. Pair it with a sock option. You can have fun that way. You can also layer with your jewelry and your accessories. So layering necklaces is a huge trend for fall and a great way to create a layered look. And of course you can add on other layers with things like sunglasses and fun extra pieces. So you can definitely have a lot of fun. I have on a layered look here with my bracelets today. So lots of versatility for those of you who are like, I'm not doing a jacket. No, thank you. Don't worry, you can create a fall layered look regardless. Now, let's talk about how you can save some money this weekend, shall we? And then I'm going to send you on your way. Don't forget, of course, I really am Brian every single week. So today I have on a flare jean. This new, this silhouette is my new favorite. I'm completely and totally obsessed. These flare jeans are incredible. Then I have on a perfect sleeve tee underneath. A little call out to those of you who are looking to kind of layer but not overheat. Just put a t-shirt on under any of these pieces and you're going to be comfortable, cozy, and cute all in one look. And then, of course, I have a jacket on here. So not a shirt, not a jacket, not heavy enough to make me die of the heat in this room right now, but also really cute and cozy and creates a fantastic fall fashion look. Of course, this jacket also has multiple ways to be worn. You can wear it buttoned up or you can wear it open like how I have it on too. So that is my outfit. I'm, of course, in Lane Bryant accessories as well. Don't forget, I always wear Lane Bryant and I always share what I wear and all of these looks over on my social too at the end of the lives. So let's talk about how you can save, shall we? We're like, let's get to it. Tell me how I can save some money. Friday and Saturday, buy one, get one, 50% off clothing, accessories, sleep, and loungewear. Yes, so many different categories for you to save so much this weekend. So let's say it again, buy one, get one, 50% off clothing, accessories, sleep, and loungewear. So Friday and Saturday, that is your sale. That is how you can save. Have some fun shopping. If you are shopping in store or online, you have the opportunity to shop virtually with Elaine Stylist online and then of course in store as well. So if you're headed into a store, be sure to get that information about Lane Stylist online. All you have to do is hit the Lane Stylist tab. It is a completely and totally free service and a great way to have some fun shopping with a friend, a partner. Those Lane Associates are there waiting for you and they're gonna help you curate a rack of clothes, especially for you, your size, your style, your taste level. So be sure to check it out on those days that you're not here with me. Fridays at 5 p.m. They're there to help you with anything that you need to create your lane. So that's it, my friends. I will see you all next Friday, 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Same place, same time. Until then, have a fantastic weekend and happy shopping.